Hey y'all, it's uh, Sunday, and so that's my usual time to do my YouTube update to see what's going on right now. So, um, <clears throat> let's see, let's get into writing. Um, I were, I added my 2,000 words. I'm up to about 8,000 into um, Jenny and Esmond, uh, no, Jenny and Dana's. There we go. Yeah, let's get the right person. Um, Jenny and Dana's story for Fayville Part 2, and I probably should reach 10,000 words into it this week. So I got um, about 28,000 more to do. Um, long story, but it's getting there. Um, I kind of have some idea where it's going, but not really, because I always just make up my stories as I go along, and the characters do what they do. So <laughs> um, uh, probably next week I will be buying um, the cover for Jordan and Esme's story. That's why they're, that they're on my mind. And um, so once I get my credit card paid down a little bit, and I made some extra money this week, so I, yeah, I'll probably get that cover made next week, and I will publish that um, once they, uh, the cover artist gives it back to me. She usually doesn't take very long. It's usually only a, like uh, three or four or five days. She She's pretty quick. So um, I'll be looking for some of the images that I want. And Crimson Roses covers are never very... Um, too uh, intense. It's just a black background. And then, you know, the, the two uh, items that I want for the story. So, um, I don't uh, really put any um, figures and stuff on Crimson Rose because it's uh, more of a, um erotic romance anyways. So, <clears throat> and then um, I also started my mailing list back up. Um, I got uh, about 28 people that joined um, through the promo that I did. I, I, I got a, a running promo right now, and I got a couple more that I already uh, signed up for later in the month and early um, next year. And then I'm going to be looking for some more. So I'm going to try to grow this newsletter again. I, I had it um, way back in 2021, evidently. So, yeah, about two years ago. And at that time, I was still uh, struggling with my finances and, and all that stuff. So I didn't really uh, keep my newsletter um, probably was a mistake, but you know, when you, when money was tight, I, I cut everything. So, um, now I have, uh, <clears throat> the finances to pay for, uh, the monthly charge. And then if I ever get, uh, enough subscribers, I, I have to pay for the newsletter itself right now. I'm just using the free version. Um, they give you like 500 people. And then if I get more than 500 people, that would be incredible. <laughs> but, um, we'll see what happens. Maybe somewhere down the line, um, but so yeah, I got about 28 uh, people that joined. Um, hasn't really done anything for my sales, but I'm gonna send out um, uh, one of my uh, first um, updates probably tomorrow. I'm thinking. So we'll see how many of those 28 people stay. But and uh, hopefully it'll help me get a little more sales uh, marketing wise. Right now, like I said, I just cut all my. Uh, Marketing. I'm going to focus on this newsletter stuff for a while, and then maybe next year I'll, I'll start doing some more Amazon ads because uh, I'll have some extra money. But we'll see what happens. So yeah, that's uh, that's it for writing right now. Um, moving on. Tomorrow is baking day as usual. Um, probably for a while. Um, I'll be cutting it out if I take off on my road trip, but it'll be uh, for now. Um, what did we? Do, uh, what I decided to going to do this week? Um, Corn. Yeah, I'm on some corn muffins. I haven't had corn muffins in a while, and I decided that's what I wanted, so I'm, I'm making corn muffins. <laughs> and uh, I'll be doing my photography stuff on Tuesday, um, taking, go to the lake, and then I'll be posting like the third week of October, so I'm getting through my uh, backlog. Um, those are kind of quick lately because there's not that many, not much going on down at the lake um, in October and November, and obviously through December. So yeah, those are getting there. And um, moving on to financial stuff, uh, my car is down to about $7,089 left because I just did my big payment. And then of course I put my $40 into VTI and SHED, so it's my 2020 split again. Um, the market's been going up, so <clears throat> excuse me. I have about uh, 85 hundred into the market now so that's kind of cool um cl closing in on my ten thousand invested which i never ever thought i would have i mean you know it's not a lot but for for me that's awesome and then my uh ira 
uh, Acorn's account is up to about 20, 22, 20, something, 2200, something like that. I don't know. It's in the, it's in the two thousands. And then I just stopped putting my money into my uh, savings account because I, I just cut that off at my 4000 but I did get my dividend, so I, I balanced it out. It's actually like 4025 bucks. And so, yeah, that's that's ongoing. Um, and then, yeah, that's that's about everything right now. Um, and then I got some money in my savings or my uh, checking account that I'm, I've been using just for other things like covers and what have you. So, yeah, those are that's going well. Um, it's kind of nice to have uh, money that I can call my own and do things with. So, awesome. Um, let's see what else is going on. Um, kind of a rainy winter so far, so I will be doing my walks. But um, they've been cold and, and dreary. Uh, I'll be going out Monday and then Friday, of course. And then I'm doing yoga tonight and Wednesday. I definitely need to do yoga tonight. My back is killing me. I don't know what's going on with my spine, but it needs to be cracked. And uh, so beyond that, um, I've just been doing some reading, and I will be doing... Uh, I did change my deliveries for December um, because it's the holiday and Christmas and winter. So I'm just going to go out for dinner. Um, it's gonna. I'm not going to make probably my 300, but I'll still be close. It'll be a little bit over two, 275, uh, give or take. Depends on how bad things are, but uh, I just... I'm, I need a, a break again from doing lunches. Um... I did that in July too, so I'm gonna uh, do it again and uh, call it the end of the year. I actually made more money this year than I did last year, so that's kind of nice, which is probably gonna put me closer to almost uh, eighteen to twenty thousand this year. Which, you know, just from doing deliveries and going to work out for going to work for about eighteen hours a week is awesome money for me. So, you know, I don't have to worry about house and kids and all that stuff. So. I can, uh, I, 18 to 20,000 plus my book money and all my other stuff that I got money coming in from is awesome. So I'm happy with that. Just if I can get my books to sell, that would be awesome. So I get a little bit of extra money more than the, you know, the couple hundred I made this year. <laughs> Cause I just finished doing taxes a while. So, okay, I guess uh, that's it. Cause I've got some stuff to do and I'm going to try to go rest my spine and snap it when I do yoga tonight. <laughs> so I will see you uh, next week with hopefully my 10,000 words added. Oh, I did um, I did one other thing this week. I did buy my window covers for my, my road trip. So all that I really want, have left to do that I'm going to really need to take with me is, um, you know, my battery uh, for charging my electronics. And then I need to buy some kitchen gear. I need some uh, pots and pans and utensils and stuff like that for cooking because I'm not going to eat out like I did. And especially when I go like in the middle of the country, um, they don't really serve vegan food in the middle of the country. I know when I went away the first time, I stopped in place in one of the Dakotas and they were like, you just want a salad with nothing on it. And I'm like, yeah, just, just a salad, no meat. And they're like, you do realize you're in, like, cattle country. We don't really just serve salads. So um, I, yeah, I'm i not going to try to do that again. And a couple times when I was away, I, I didn't get anything for breakfast. So all they had was, like, berries on the uh, buffet. But I'm not going to stay in hotels this time anyways. So, yeah, I got to get some kitchen supplies. So this is uh, longer than I wanted to be, but I will see you next week.